Okay, so you know, today we're going to do uh, a segment that is going to talk about a couple of kids in New York got meningitis. And as a matter of fact, a counselor got meningitis and, and, and he died uh, from meningitis. And we keep saying, you know, that especially kids that go to dorms, and th this happened in a private school, um, you got to think about vaccinating those kids for meningococcal meningitis before they go to school. Because, you know, teenagers, no matter what happens, they, they share things with each other, Coke and Pepsi and the hamburger and whatever. Uh, they don't wash their hands. And what happens is if one kid gets meningitis, then everybody that came in contact with that kid is going to get it. And if that kid comes from, from school, folks, and he's complaining of malaise, I don't feel good, I have a headache, my neck hurts, you got to rush to the emergency room. You cannot assume that it's the kid is tired because that's what happened in this school. The counselor died and two other kids passed away from meningitis. Now the school is closed, everybody's closing, uh, cleaning everything, and the kids that were in contact with this boy are now getting antibiotics. So beware of meningitis because this is something that your kid may get. Dr. Manny, keep it alive.